on the road in Brooklyn against the Nets, uh, what are some keys and, and what are some of the things that you think has to happen for the uh, Cavs to beat the Nets that would put them in as the seventh seed? Now, of course, I just said, you know, just go win the first one, not have to worry about the second one. What, easier said than done, especially against the Brooklyn Nets team and on the road that you just faced. And it the, the key is going to be off is going to be getting out to a, a better start than the last game in the or second to last game in the regular season, I should say. When you only scored 19 points in the first first quarter, then you score 19 points in the fourth quarter after about 35 in the second and third. And you take that five point lead from the third to the fourth quarter. So one thing is you want to get out to a better start. And even if they ride the, the wave of their crowd, stem the tide. Uh, another key is this young team is going to have to grow up very quickly. It's going to have to find its composure in a more hostile environment on the road. It's hostile anyways, always on the road when you go to Brooklyn. But in this game, those fans are going to be smart enough to know that this is still a playoff level game. The, they have guys on that team with the Nets, and especially with KD and Kyrie, are going to play a lot of minutes. They're going to probably score a lot of points. You got to try to slow them down. It's not easy, but just keep your composure and know, hey, we came back in the last game. We just didn't finish down the stretch. We got a little momentum now. We need to start strong. We can, If we can maintain in the middle like we did the last time and have a much stronger finish, we're going to give ourselves a chance, and that's what you ask for on the road. When you give yourself a chance and you make the team that's at home, the crowd, you make them doubt a little bit, now the pressure starts to mount on them, and you can just go play a little bit more free on the basketball court. Yep, and um, the thing I would say is Coro has to do some things defensively on Kyrie Irvin, make him work. Same thing Mobley on Durant, make him work. You're not going to shut him down, make him work, no easy baskets.